You know, a lot of times when you are writing a MATLAB program and you run it, you get a bunch of results and you don't really know what uh, the output is referring to. In this case, for example, I have created two transfer functions. And while I'm getting that result, what I would like to know is a way to identify what each transfer function is for whenever I run my program. Now I can do that with comments, but what I want to do is identify them on the output. A way to do that is to use the disp command. So you type disp, open parentheses, and let's say uh, this is my transfer function for GS. And let's say that my second transfer function is for C of S. And you can type anything you want between these two single quotes. Let's go ahead and run the program. And now I've uh, identified each of my transfer functions. So remember that a good way to get some meaningful results in your output is to use the this command. And that way not just you but older people will know what the output of your program is referring to. That's it for this video. Thank you for watching.